Shane's plan here, and I've noticed that when I calibrate my King Song really well, it rides really well, and I like to check it on occasion, but this whole calibration thing is, <laughs> I haven't figured out a way to easily hold it level on all four axes, so I'm going to go through this painstaking make sure it's level task, and I purchased one of these. This is a 60 millimeter level, and all I have to do is figure out if it gives me repeatable results when I toss it down on the wheel. And I did try to tape it to the top of the wheel, because I was thinking, hell, at three or five dollars a piece, I'll just buy a bunch of them and glue them to each one of my wheels, which is an option. But unfortunately, I run out of, you know, it's, it's enough room to reach. But once I put the cover over it, then I'm rubbing on my cover. And I could see people that don't have really thin fingers having a problem. Like, well, maybe I'll just toss it down on the wheel, which that actually works really fairly well. If I just take it and toss it down on there. It's not centered. Centered on the sticker. Showing fairly level. So I will probably sand down this center nub here and uh, it straddles the sticker well enough. You see there's a little play on this wheel. That works. Alright. And then I've got to the back. It's sitting level. So uh, yeah, let me calibrate my real wheel real quickly. Cool. Set it any. Bluetooth is connected. All right. And we're back to. Bluetooth is connected. Should we back to rock? Anyway, oh, that's off level. So let's see. That is perfectly level from front to back. The wheel is not fighting at all. So yeah, 60 millimeter balanced disc. Toss it on top of the unicycle, and that'll get you pretty good. You just have to you have to try it once to make sure that your sticker isn't in the way or that your case isn't. But I'm you know, let's see. Wonder. Wonder what this one says. Yeah, not so good for the M10. Maybe on the very top of the handle. Yeah. Let's see, that gets in the ballpark for the M10 too. Of course, it doesn't have a calibration, does it? So, I guess that's kind of the hook point. And that's the sound of my Bluetooth that's not worth a shit. Now I'm fully calibrated, and I have no doubt in my mind that this will ride like a dream.